tough one today against Georgia Tech. It, it looked like it really changed in the first five, seven minutes after halftime. What, what happened to that part of the game? Um, you know, I felt like we just, you know, we really stopped playing. And, you know, we let them attack us way too much. Um, you know, they're a tough physical team. And, you know, once you let guys like them get going, you know, they really have, uh, you know, all the momentum behind them, you know, to continue throughout the rest of the game. And uh, I just felt like we didn't stop it, you know, early enough. We kind of knew their defense was one of the best in the league coming in. What, what about that defense presented so many troubles today? Uh, it's just it's just something that you don't see all the time. It's like it's a weird it's a weird zone, weird matchup zone. Um, you know that's why it really throws teams off. Um, honestly, uh, you know Virginia Tech had a tough time against us, mm -hmm. uh, against them. And uh, you know today we you know we kind of struggled really finding our spots. You know um, you know myself and you know Tyus and Elijah and Frank we didn't really you know know where to you know get scoring um, in those areas, but. You know, like you said, they, they have one of the you know, best defenses in the league, so you just got to adjust better. I guess uh, in the first half, certainly they forced you into a, a lot of threes and, and some went in. How tough was it just to, to get the ball inside the three-point line of parts? Um, you know, I felt like, you know, we settled way more than we should have, honestly. Uh, we have guys that, you know, are you know, lethal off the bounce, and, you know, we should have used it to our advantage. Um, you know, if, if a guy's flying out on us, that's, you know, really an open opportunity to beat him. You know, one, two dribbles, get it close to the basket, kick it out for a wide open three, or, you know, we'll get straight to the basket. But I just feel like we settled way too much. It's, it's not really anything that they did, you know, um, that really forced us into those threes. And lastly, we know it's a quick turnaround. You're at Duke on Monday. How, how tough is this turnaround to go see maybe the best team in the league right now? Uh, it's tough. It's tough. But, um, you know, this is, you know, this is why we come here. It's why we want to play these games. Um, you know, quick turnaround we just got to forget about today and, uh, you know, move on. You know, like you said, one of the best teams in the country, honestly. Um, so, you know, we just got to, you know, refocus, regroup, and, you know, get back together. All right. Appreciate the time, Oshay. No problem. Thank you. Tyus battle here and uh, certainly a tough one all around. Quiet locker room in here. What happened first five, seven minutes of the second half? Uh, we weren't making shots. That's really it. And they were getting on transition. And certainly forced into tough shots, it looked like. How, how tough was this Georgia Tech defense to go against today? Um, I think it's just we weren't making shots. We were getting open looks. We weren't making shots. So if you're going to shoot that bad, we're not going to win. When you come into a game like this, you were 2-0 in the league and playing pretty well. How tough is this to get through when it looked like you guys had it going a little bit that it went away today? Um, I mean, losses happen. Uh, ACC is a tough conference. I mean, if you're not ready to play, you're going to get beat. Uh, Georgia Tech's a really good team, well coached, and uh, they got after it today. We know how tough it is. It's just two days from now. you got to play one of the top teams in the league in Duke. What's the key here over the next 48 hours to get ready for that game? Um, put this behind you. Um, Look at the film and just get ready for them. All right, Taz, thanks a lot. Thank you.